This is Gene Key, KDDD News. MyHighPlains.com reports despite recent moisture from snow and rain, area land remains under extreme drought conditions, which is prompting commissioners in two counties to enforce a fireworks ban. It has rained and snowed the past few weeks, but to no avail. Randall County Fire Chief James Emerson says drought conditions in the Panhandle are extreme, even worse now than this summer. The fire hazard has prompted commissioners in both Potter and Randall counties to enforce a ban on the sale and use of certain types of fireworks. The decision was made in anticipation of firework sales surrounding New Year's Eve celebrations. The ban is on aerial fireworks or bottle rockets, which include any sky rockets with sticks and missiles with fins. So far, no word from Moore County on the fireworks ban. Selling, detonating, or igniting any of these fireworks in both Potter and Randall counties will be punishable as a Class C misdemeanor. The ban will last until January 1, 2012. Collaboration is helping our local community colleges contend with less money and more students. Three area community colleges recently got together to announce the beginning of what's been termed a unique partnership. Frank Phillips College, Amarillo College, and Clarendon College announced an arrangement reportedly intended to ease and improve the student transfer process, align programs and program offerings, and most importantly, leverage resources all towards the ultimate goal of helping students earn a college degree, no matter which college being attended. Each of the three colleges say they offer signature programs in addition to strong academic transfer classes and some traditional programs in nursing, welding, and cosmetology. If you like the latest Dumas, Panhandle, and Texas news on your mobile device, you can follow KDDD News on YouTube. Simply search KDDD or Gene Key on Facebook or Twitter. This is Gene Key, KDDD News.